Hey there, Jonesy here from Nexa 3D Support, and I'm gonna show you some quick and dirty tips on how to remove parts from your build plate. First things first, we're going to wear our personal protective equipment in order to protect our skin from the liquid resin. Always be sure to wear nitrile gloves whenever you're handling liquid resin. Once you get your gloves on, go ahead and open the printer, lower the lever for the locking mechanism to get the build plate out, and nice. Looks like I've got a successful print of these five keychains that I printed earlier this afternoon. I'm gonna place the print on a sturdy work surface so that the print is facing away from me at an angle. I'm gonna use the metal spatula from the finishing kit, which does have some sharp corners, so be sure to handle with the same respect that you would a box cutter. You can use the spatula as a kind of lever to pop each of the parts off of the build plate. You're basically guillotining these off the build plate, so cut away from your body and hands. You also wanna be mindful of how hard you're pressing with the spatula as you don't wanna gouge the build plate. Any gouges or raised edges on the build plate could cause some punctures on the membrane, so just watch out for that. So let's take a look at this keychain. Yep, this bad Larry is ready for the wash. So that'll be the next step. But in the meantime, go ahead and wipe down your build plate so that it's ready for action the next time you wanna print, and I will see you in the next one.